you feeling? Pretty good. Yeah. Pretty good. I get to marry my best friend, so that's, that's exciting. I am pumped. I don't know what I'm going to do in the next like two or three minutes, but. Justin, <laughs> if your 12-year-old self could see what his future wife looked like, I think <laughs> I think that he would be more than okay skipping recess so he could hurry and grow up to marry her. twin is a very unique experience and sharing your life with somebody is a special special thing you have your best friend always there and even though we're totally two different people you're my best friend I have seriously enjoyed watching the two of you flourish and become who you are today it's just so awesome to find that love and to watch you guys have the love that mom and dad do after 29 years, you know, the way that you guys look at each other. I think that eternity falls in love with the creations of what we do here in our time. And right now, I think that eternity is smiling from ear to ear. I think that eternity is in love with what you two have created together. Justin and Madison, what you've accomplished here today is no small feat. Your journey began way before you sent out the invitations. All those conversations in the car or over dinner included someday and somehow and maybe. All of those common hopes and dreams and the vows that you're about to take are a way of saying to one another, you remember all of those things that we promised and hoped for. Well, I meant it, every single word. I will share my life with yours and build our dreams together. Support you through times of trouble and rejoice with you in times of happiness. I promise to give you respect, love, and loyalty. This commitment is made in love, kept in faith, lived in hope, and made new every day of our lives. 